Hey everybody, welcome back. Jody King here, Jody King channel here on YouTube. And if you saw the previous video, I talked about how there are some really common mistakes that abstract expressionist artists um, make. I uh, talked about how this has come up because I've been teaching, uh, I taught a workshop last week, I'll be teaching one this coming week. Um, and I just see like, th this is like 95% of the mistakes that we make as ex abstract expressionists over, over and over again. So I'm gonna try to fix, hopefully, some of the mistakes in this painting. And just from the get-go, the first thing that I talked about is that oftentimes there's just not enough expression in the painting itself. So for this painting here, um, I don't hate it. I mean, it's fine, but um, I don't feel like it's really an expression of the type of work that I like to do or an expression really of myself. Now, for someone else, it, it, it's totally different because that's you know your personal expression, so that's awesome. But for me, this just doesn't have um, enough uh, oomph or something that I want. And so it just, feels like there's just not enough expression in it. Now, I've been sitting with it actually for about, I don't know, maybe three weeks because I am attached to it. I think the colors are kind of cool and um, I like some of these blues, I like this orange. Um, I had it rearranged to where this orange was at the top and I really liked that orientation. So what I did is I went ahead and I flipped it so that I could get out of my head and um, become less attached to the outcome of the painting, which is another one of the mistakes that we make is we get too attached too early. So I've already mixed up some paint here. I've created a lot of different values and uh, wish me luck. All right, here we go. I talked about that a little bit on the previous video as well is like if you're attached, just keep spinning. Yeah, I'm already liking that better because it's just so much more expressive, right? Thank you. 
leave it there for now. It feels um, feels really super expressive, and uh, I don't know. It's something about the unfinishedness of it, or the I don't know. It's but it's feeling really really good. So uh, you can see that from the uh, the painting that I started with to now, this one is just so much more expressive and to me alive and feels really uh, energetic and fun. So, okay, I'm gonna stop there. I hope that was helpful to you. Uh, if you like what you see here, uh, please like and subscribe. And if you've got any comments about any of this, then please um, leave a comment. Have a great day, peace out.